What up, it's your boy, the Incredible Man, and yes, I am back at it again, and this is Jobless Reincarnation, episode six, man. Last week, we get to see Rudy in a pinch and being saved and doing some saving. There was a lot of stuff going on last week, man, and you guys were definitely spot on. That was a lot of stuff for a seven-year-old kid to actually see, and you guys definitely made some valid points as well with um, Rudy technically being seven, but technically being older then seven at the same time but doesn't really have any outside world experience i mean basically he's like an actual seven-year-old kid he doesn't have like the knowledge and everything you know he became a shut-in because of what actually happened to him so like his mindset is still kind of immature and young but that, that even if you're an adult man that was some that was some traumatic stuff regardless last week was crazy man let's check out episode six and see what's popping off I don't think I do it good, no, I think I do it great They would do it if they could, they can't do it so they hate Everybody wanna look, but nobody wanna play Stealing eyes Not really though, man Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Yeah, well. <laughs> Officially, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you can't have a kid run around, you know, killing people and stuff. Oh, they don't want the other members of the family to know about Rudy. Yeah, because it'd be a bad thing if they knew about you. Oh, hey, she got a bad. Hey, she got a bad. <laughs> oh, so she one of those kind. She must not like Paul. So a lot of people don't like Paul. Like they pissed at Paul. Is that Paul's father? Oh no. That's that's his father. <laughs> don't lie to me, boy. <laughs> oh day Oh wow So the gray arts got they got a lot of they got a lot of pull, right? In political power. And, you know, of course, royalty is always. Dang. So that's where she learns how to act like that. Wow. That was smooth, Rudy. That was smooth, Rudy. Oh, yeah, this dude is this dude is something else. That's what she acts like that from him. She gets that from him. Oh, wow. <laughs> that is not how you ask nobody for anything. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> 
<laughs> oh my gosh. What is that? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. This anime is too legit, man. Every week I am fascinated and in love with everything that's taking place. And I gotta say, I'm enjoying the way that the opening actually takes place as well. We get to see so much stuff. And we kind of understand what Ares acts the way that she acts because of her grandfather and her father, of course. And they pamper her a little bit. And But something's up with her mother. And look at Ghislaine. Or Ghislaine, however you want to say it. But she does know the sword. Oh, so what, he's teaching Ghislaine um, fire too? I mean, magic? Well, she picked it up kind of fast. Dang. Dude, every week I'm, I'm infatuated with everything in this series, man. It looks great. Wow, he's still infatuated with Roxy. Well, I mean, that's that's a given, man. Dude, this anime is so lovely, man. You'll be setting fires inside the house. Wait, did she leave? She left already? <laughs> when it comes to actual learning, she's gone. <laughs> but with magic, she's totally fine. But like anything else, she doesn't want to hear it. She's like, right, now she's like a little angel. I'll teach you some math. <laughs> Rudy, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> Ooh. He got too comfortable with it. Oh, you fool! Don't do don't do anything stupid. Don't don't do nothing stupid. Oh my God! Look at his face. Look at look at his fingers. <laughs> no. No, she's waking up. You fool! <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh dude. <laughs> he was asking for that. And he's put on the front. Oh my gosh. Rudy's the goat, man. Oh my gosh. Wink, 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 wink.
Uh oh, she's hooked. Okay, that's cool. But they don't get caught to the whole plan, man. Well, that's true. Oh, my God. Oh, my, oh, my God. It makes my stomach ache. Oh, she's hooked like, she's hooked like. <laughs> oh, now she, now she want to learn math. Uh-oh. It actually worked. Son, this anime is legit, man. Uh-oh. Oh, dude. She's good with the sword. Son, Eris is putting in work, man. Son, she is molly this dude, man. <laughs> I give up. I quit. I don't want to learn the sword anymore. Well, that's true, too, though. Oh, you need to get out of that, man. <laughs> I guess he can't help it then. <laughs> I can't. But that'll get him prepared for, like, actual battles, too, though. He'll still be a little terrified, but he won't be as terrified. But you're learning stuff at the same time, so it's not just earning money. Oh, it's not just Roxy. He, he done everybody. Sylphie, his parents, the horse. Oh, okay. Oh, he was just bored. Oh, five years. Dang. That's a long time, man. Uh oh, she's agitated. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Why are you attacking me, man? <laughs> Mentally speaking, of course, because I saw some stuff. Oh. <laughs> she she didn't even take the government. <laughs> you shut up. <laughs> But she didn't punch you. It was just like a light little tap. So do with that what you will. 
So do y'all, do you see that camera angle? Like, it's, psh, psh. <laughs> uh, it looks fun like a festival. Oh, is it just like regular everyday stuff? That's pretty. It lets you go 10 times without pulling out. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Ghislaine's actually learning. <laughs> Does she really get it? <laughs> Oh, so he's not even worried about the aphrodisiac anymore. Oh, so this episode is crazy, man. <laughs> yeah, because she had a bunch of books. <laughs> what are you gonna do Ruby well that's true <laughs> that's too little <laughs> I can't get paid what she does. <laughs> right, she does way more and she's ranked. But she is learning though, so I'm really enjoying that part. She actually is learning something. Oh, she's super happy now. What the crap is that? Floating city in the sky. Armored Dragon King.
no, nah, we don't know anything about that. Well, now this is interesting. Wait, so is it true then? It's not just a fairy tale? That's crazy. More than likely, he's probably dead. That's 400 years, dude. But if he is alive, that's that's another story that'd be definitely cool to uh, figure out. <laughs> she brought the aphrodisiac. Oh wow. <laughs> I mean, he took it. He took it. He took it. <laughs> Let's get back to studying. <sighs> oh my gosh. He took it. He took it. <laughs> Don't change the subject. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> no. No! <laughs> Did you say aphrodisiac? <laughs> well, uh, you see. Oh my gosh, this episode went by too fast, man. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Oh, man. If you guys saw me, man, and if you enjoyed my reaction, you guys know that I had a blast with today's episode. And that was Jobless Reincarnation Episode 6. And oh my gosh, it was glorious, man. Like, it was hilarious throughout. There was It was a little information, and we got to see that Ghislaine and um, Edis both are actually really learning something. And both of them have kind of opened up to Rudy a little bit, and there's a different dynamic going on be between the three characters, and they enjoy each other's company. But we see that Eris' mother has a problem with Rudy. Like, Maybe not Rudy himself, but just in general. Maybe because he's uh, Paul's son or something. So it probably has something to do with that. Because just the way that she looked at him, and then we just never see her again this episode. But like when they were introduced, that moment she looked at him with such disdain. Like it was like, ugh, he's Paul's son. So it's like, there's definitely something there. There's a story going on there that I would love to know more about. Because. Aries' mom out here looking, looking kind of right, man. I'm just saying. I'm just being honest. Um, she's no Ghislaine, of course, but she she out here in her own right. She's out here. Wow. Um. Overall, man, it was a nice, fun episode. It was relaxing, if you ask me. It was very relaxing. We just got to have the time to see um Rudy kind of like embrace Aries and Aries embrace him and Ghislaine embrace Rudy and their whole little trio kind of just have a relaxation period and they went they spent some time on the town and we see that their products of their learning is starting to pay off for both of them, which is Aries and Ghislaine is starting to pay off in both of them. And, um, it just was a nice episode, man. We got introduced to Aries, 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 Aries um, grandfather, which we can kind of see where she gets her attitude from. Like, or like he, he kind of rubbed off on her a little bit and, and that's kind of the way she acts a little bit. But it was a fun overall, just a glorious episode, man. I, I enjoyed it. I was laughing the entire time. And this series always brings a smile to my face. And, man, I can't wait for the next week's episode because some stuff is going down, man. 
Um, this week, it was just fun and relaxing, but I feel like we're going to dive into something next week because we got a little more information about a hero this week as well. He lives in the castle in the sky, and it's been 400 years, and they named a calendar after him. So there's a lot of stuff going on to unpack there. We got to learn a little bit of the history of Paul's um, adventures with Ghislaine, his wife. So, like, there's some stuff to unpack there. It was informative, but it was more of a relaxation enjoyment episode, and I enjoyed the entire episode, man. This is your boy, Dick Incredible. Don't forget to smash the like button so you can't smash any more. Comment down below, and I'll be sure to respond to each and every one of them and subscribe, but only if you really want to, man. And remember, the anime matters, anime is greatness, and anime is life, man. Peace out. Today, yeah, I